Hi, Shelly. Oh, hey, Van. Finally, I found you. What's going on? Oh, this is so neat. We're going to be in a road rally. A road race? That's awesome. No, 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 no. This is not a race against time or speed. No. This is a race that's involved with how well we can navigate accurately. Something you probably could stand some help on, Van. Oh, hey, and this is Brad Ball. He's from the Geographic Information Team, and hey. he's in charge of the road rally. Hey, guys. Shelly, Van, this is a special road rally. No maps allowed. We're only going to use GPS receivers. What's a GPS receiver? GPS stands for Global Positioning System. This little device, a GPS receiver, is the future of navigation. So just how does this GPS receiver work, and how are we supposed to use it in this road rally? The Global Positioning System is a constellation of 24 satellites that orbit the Earth. GPS makes it possible for people using ground receivers to determine their geographic location. By measuring the travel time of a signal transmitted from each satellite, a receiver can calculate its distance from the satellite. When receiving the signals from at least four satellites, a receiver can determine the latitude, longitude, altitude, and time. If the receiver is equipped with a computer that has a map, the position is shown on the map. If you are moving, a receiver may also tell you your speed, direction of travel, and estimated time of arrival at the destination. Oh, okay. I think I understand now how we're supposed to use this receiver in this rally. This receiver will help us navigate to each of our destination points, but we only have a certain amount of time to get there. Which means speed is important. So, I'm driving. Wrong van on both points. In a rally, you maintain the posted speed limit. Using the posted speed limit, plus the distance to each checkpoint, we have calculated the time it should take you. Ah, time equals distance divided by speed. Right. Now program this receiver with your checkpoint coordinates. Your challenge is to find each point. The time and accuracy of finding each point contributes to your score. Shelly, you're the driver. Van, you're the navigator. Okay. One final rule. Here's your logbook. This must be signed and time stamped at each checkpoint. Also, at each checkpoint, you're to collect the information on the navigation and how GPS applies to the featured site and get a clue to the next leg of your trip. Wait for the green light. I'll send each crew one minute apart. All right, Brad, I think we're ready, okay? All right, all of us, how about hopping in? We've got room in the back. You can come along, help us collect the information, and maybe look over Van's shoulder. He'll probably need the help. Let's go. still think you should have let me drive. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> navigate. You navigate. I drive. 